One of the things that surprised us is just how crazy people can sometimes go over champagne and how much they crave it. My grandfather drank champagne pretty much every day, certainly for either lunch or dinner. He said that it stirs the spirit, and it does. Most people remember the first part of the sentence, I go to bed with a single drop of channel number five on me. They forgot the second part, which was, and I wake up with a glass of Piper Heidsieck. It warms my body up. When we launch this bottle, we can say that it has been seen in Champagne, very traditional, like a UFO in the landscape of Champagne. We use Bollinger being the Champagne of James Bond, and we promote the launch of the film in 90 countries. Tonight, we will bring some champagne to the EE BAFTA ceremony. Dom Perignon is the father of champagne. Remembering what Dom Pierre Perignon was saying, discovering the bubble in this bottle and drinking stars. Although Dom Perignon is called the father of champagne, Dom Perignon didn't invent champagne. We turned them into sparkling wines long before Dom Perignon ever set foot in Champagne. So this day will be when you will have uh, no more rain in England. We've got a monarch in her 90s who loves sparkling wine, and she's got her own vineyard, Windsor Great Park Vineyard. Do the English actually make wine? If they want to take a shower with weekends, that's fine with me. <laughs> Once again, Santé. Mmm, very nice.